What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. This reading here is for my Scorpio Zodiac signs. Let's dive in and see what message comes out for you. So let's get one card. What's going on with Scorpio at this moment? Energy for my Scorpio. Energy for my Scorpios. What's going on with Scorpio, please, spirit? Planner. Bottom of the deck is media. Okay. So planners, pay attention to details and create a plan to grow your business or personal finances. Careers in event planning, project manager, or professional organizer could be for you. And this is a great time to take a financial inventory and see what needs changing. Okay. Media is at the bottom of the deck. Step into the spotlight and get seen. Don't allow your talent to go unnoticed. A career in television, radio, magazine, or any mass media job might be perfect for you. And it might be time to get more publicity if you want to increase your finances. So a lot of y'all could be in the media, okay? Maybe you have like a platform. Um, this could be, you know, some sort of online uh, thing for you as well. Others of you, you could literally like be on TV, that type of energy. But for a lot of y'all, I see you planning things out, trying to like work smarter, not harder type of energy. Some of y'all, y'all may be buying like a planner this week. Some of y'all, y'all have like y'all sales stuff like online. There is a net in here. It's driving me insane. Some of y'all have like, um, y'all sell things online. So y'all could be like checking your inventory. What's going on? Seven of cups. Some of y'all have multiple streams of income. So you're looking at different options to do when it comes to work. Yeah. Queen of swords energy being very logical, making head over heart decisions. This is someone who's also, um, very intellectual, very analytical. So you could be like going over a lot of paperwork right now. Some of y'all make sure you have your I's dotted, T's crossed. If you need to get anything like, um, what's it called? Like LLC, stuff like that. I see you getting that done. What's going on? The high priestess. Oh Yeah. And the Wheel of Fortune. If you're planning on doing something as far as business, it's going to be turning in your favor. The Wheel of Fortune is about faded change, good luck, destiny type of energy. It's about making um, it's cycles and it's uh, fortune. Okay, yeah, there may be upheaval getting this planned out, but I see a lot of options coming in for you, Scorpio. Let's see what the Seven of Cups is about. Ooh, it's kind of cold in here. I need to turn it here down. What's that Seven of Cups about? I'm about to put my robe on. That's what I'm doing. What's that Seven of Cups about for Scorpio? What's the Seven of Cups for Scorpio? Y'all may have, yeah, crown, overcoming obstacles, power play, wealth, owner boss, taking charge, making progress. Yeah, a lot of y'all are like opening up businesses. Maybe you have multiple streams of income. I see a lot of wealth coming in for you, or you have opportunities to make a lot of uh, wealth with these different options, okay? Yeah, some of y'all, y'all need to just use your imagination, meditate on it, see which which is the right direction. Don't overwhelm yourself when it comes to all these different options. But I see you making progress, okay? Bottom of the deck is turtle. Yeah, money coming slowly, steady progress. So I see you working towards it. What's the Queen of Swords for Scorpio when it comes to money, finances, and career? Butterfly, sudden change, frivolous spending, short-term loan, arts, movement, temp jobs, and fun work. So a lot of y'all enjoy what you do when it comes to this Queen of Swords energy. You have, um, you, a lot of y'all, it says right decisions. So you know how to make the right decisions, when to spend, when not to spend. Um, some of y'all could be investing in like a loan or seeing what you need to do to get approved for a loan in order to move forward when it comes to your job, things like that. Um, y'all could have went through some sort of hardship at this moment or y'all went through some sort of hardship. So you're trying to be analytical, like, okay, what do I need to spend? What do I need to do? What type of loan do I need to take out? Blah, 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 that type of energy. Seal business contract, documents, gift, or money. Yeah, writing, clerical, paperwork, staying put. Yeah, a lot of y'all are doing like paperwork, analyzing things, going over things, balancing your checkbook, that type of energy. What else? Uh, yeah, because we're going to pull up. We're going to pull some uh, fortune cookies on these too. All right, so, but I see, I see some sort of transformation happening here when it comes to your money. And it's going to be because you're, again, you're going over things, you're being analytical, you're looking at it, you're seeing, okay, where I can spend, where I can't spend, what I need to invest in, what type of loan do I need to take out. I see, like, you're you're really cracking down on your business. I like that. What's the high priestess? This is about listening to your intuition. Yeah, coins, money coming in, wealth, good investment, sales and finance, getting a raise, and lucky. A lot of y'all know y'all about to walk into some money. Y'all know, it's like, you're, some of y'all could do divination. You could do tarot like me, or uh, you could be some sort of like light worker. 
This is also discovering your truth, seeing where it is that you fit in. We have the chess card, money strategy, wise spending, long game, military leader, thinking it through. Yeah, a lot of y'all are using your intuition to go towards what's meant for you. Some of y'all feel something coming in, too. It's like y'all have the spiritual insight to know that something's coming towards you, the wisdom and knowledge. Some of y'all are using the wisdom and knowledge that you've gained over time with that queen of swords of, like, taking losses, taking ills, and learning from that, growing from that in order to make more money, too. Seven of Cups. What message do you have for the Seven of Cups for Scorpio when it comes to money and finances? All right, difficult times. Be on your guard against chaos. It's unforeseen perils or emotional upheaval are foretold. So a lot of y'all, again, because you have all these different options coming in, you could be looking at different avenues of how to make money. So just be careful. Queen of Swords. What message do you have for the Queen of Swords? Future. You may travel or host an overseas traveler soon. Either way, great social fun awaits. So some of y'all could be getting your travel papers, to, paper, papers, papers together. Mm -hmm. This could also be communication. A lot of people could come to you for knowledge because of what you know they could pay you because of that. What's the high priestess for Scorpio? The high priestess is major life change. Told you, time is right for major life changes as a new lifestyle or location brings great joy and a trouble-free existence. Again, you know there is some sort of change happening. You could feel it. I'm hearing that song. Coming to me at night. Uh -huh. okay anyway so y'all feel this y'all y'all it's like y'all trusting y'all having faith that spirit is uh guiding you to where you need to that your intuition is trusting what you need to invest in so y'all are about to go through a major life change you got luck on the bottom a sudden change of luck is likely things are working in your favor excellent time for networking let me see what this high priestess is about can you clarify the high priestess for scorpio with this high priestess triangle major mature woman socialite connector high society some of y'all may be like partnering up with a couple people or you're going to have choices on who to work with who not to work with make sure you don't get involved in any type of like drama when it comes to this triangle energy because it has crowded relationship and choices so make sure you're working with the right people you're choosing the right people to work with you don't want to you don't want it to be it's like too much competition where it may cause um problems here but if if y'all aren't this mature woman or man, where where it says socialite connector or high society, y'all are gonna be meeting somebody. Y'all could be like in a business room or something like that. Y'all y'all are gonna be meeting somebody that has a lot of good connections for you. That's gonna help you get these um, options and wishes and opportunities off the ground. Ooh, I like that. Clarify that uh, high priestess, please, spirit. Clarify the high priestess. Some of y'all could be going on a business trip or you, you'll you get invited on a business trip. You have getting a room, hotel, motel, suite, business, and pleasure. Some of y'all, y'all may be on like vacation and you actually meet somebody, like a, a person that you can connect with that's going to help help you make money. It's like something about you meeting somebody or meeting the right person. Like this is like you say you sell makeup, right? And you end up meeting somebody that does makeup online. And then and you're like, hey, you know, and you get to talking. You're like, hey, and they're like, hey, I will definitely promote your product. And then boom. Like you got a connection there. You see what I'm saying? It's something like that. Check yourself is at the bottom of the deck. So make sure you're being in this professional manner. Okay. You're trusting your intuition that is guiding you towards the right people to work with, to socialize with. Okay. You don't want to get involved with no messy people. Okay. All right. Well, I think that's what you need to know as of now, Scorps. Last one. Okay. Last one. Last message. Last message for Scorpio. Last message. We have lion harness the loyal and protective aura of the lion and charge ahead magnificently yeah go forward scorpio be courageous be confident and get out there because y'all about to like walk into a lot of abundance plain a journey is indicated either physically or metaphorically your life will become more full y'all about to be busy now i'm here getting paid little baby getting paid i don't know <laughs> so y'all about to y'all about to travel or you, this is a journey like online, something like that, something to do with travel forward movement, okay? If you've been feeling stagnant, all right, y'all about to overcome all of that here, okay? Y'all about to step into some abundance, baby. So I'm gonna leave it there. Lucky time for you, Scorpio. This is what I have for you. Hope it brings you clarity and insight. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.